Hey everybody, welcome back to Carriage Place, uh, Chrono Cross. We, we, what the fuck are, are we? we doing? Yeah, where are we? Uh, Termina? Termina. So this is a new session. I always like to tell people that, it's just so that they know what they're getting into. Yeah, we don't have short-term memory loss, we <laughs> think. <laughs> um, Lasers. Is this, well, I think yeah, we talked, we, yeah, we Yeah, were we in went there. in there and we talked to the fun guy. Ooh, yeah, that guy was pretty fun. Um, and we saw Glenn, he was trying to buy flowers. We met Guile, who's like uh, an edgelord. Before we go too far, let's uh, explore that first screen okay. to its full extent. Alrighty. We, so we were in the bar, oh, that's and we where saw Guile's, Guile. yeah, yeah, Guile's in the bar. Oh, I forgot to look up. Oh, no, let's uh, <laughs> stay on the main What's screen, What's on the main man? screen, man? There's like, nothing on the main screen. Oh, let's, let's stay on that main screen. Alright. Jesus. Um... Oh, there's Nikki. Uh, posters of Nikki. Best of Viper, I'm here to polish your statue again. <laughs> oh, wait. I, I love <laughs> polishing your statue, Mr. Viper. Master Viper. All right, all oh, squeaky clean. It's got to be extra clean for the coming festivities. Have you folks come to see the Viper Festival? To mean it's peaceful thanks to watchful eye of our Master Viper. At times warm, at times strict, Master Viper watches over us always. That's With that creepy. said, of course, the real Master Viper resides in his manor, along with his acacia. Okay. Yeah, what are we calling these? Uh, acacia? Uh, yeah, I like that. Or acacia? Acacia. <laughs> I do like acacia as well. Acacia dragoons. If you allow me to brag a little bit, I was invited to the manor a while back. It is a magnificent place. If there is a heaven on earth, that would be it. The manor is beautiful and its design incorporates the surrounding terrain to its advantage, making it an impenetrable fortress. On top of that, there are powerful soldiers standing guard in front of the main gates that can destroy any monster with just one blow. Wow. <laughs> well, an yeah, upright... Yeah, cross is a little wordy. <laughs> it's not like modern... Japanese role-playing games. Okay. Yes, it is. It's... Okay. It's wordy. It is wordy for the era. Okay. Well, an upright citizen like myself might be invited to the manor's garden party, but not so for you folks. The most you will get is a cool reception from the gate. <laughs> gate guards. Yeah, yeah. I, that's what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's settled. We've got to sneak into Viper Manor. You gotta find out what those Akakia Dragoons are up to, right? <laughs> Baby. <laughs> Baby. Baby. Why, why was Cars trying to capture you? I got some business there as well, so I'll go with you. How about it, Sergey? Uh. Alright, so since I got punished by Joe the last time that I jumped into a decision, is this gonna oh, no, F I us over on some character? Not that I'm... Actually, I'm... No, I'm not actually sure. I just knew that we were missing out on Lena. And then the thing is, like, I like Lena more than Poshal, but I'm just barely. Okay. So, like, I don't know. Do what okay, you want, man. Okay, let's go. It's obvious choice, right? You sound like Finn from Adventure Time. <laughs> For my Sergei or my kid? No, you said, let's go. Oh, okay. <laughs> Adventure Time. And you're Jake the Dog? Are you Jake the dog and I'm Finn the human? I'm kind of Jake the dog, and you are kind of Finn the human, with your like long flowing golden locks, mm -hmm. and my hat that I always wear. According to Grandpa here, this Viper Manor is a bloody large place, which also means it'll be easy to break into. There's got to be more than one way, and if we don't plan this right, it'll cost us our lives. Crikey! Sit on a crocodile. <laughs> Are we going to just start inventing Australian <laughs> Oh, so much. I'll bite my knob. Whoa. <laughs> Ouch. God, I love this environmental detail. And, and that. Oh, go ahead. And that is how the six great dragons sealed the dark evil and restored peace to the land. The end. Baba, do dragons really exist? How big are they? No, you stupid kid. This is a silly fairy tale. The old people made it up. But Baba, Corsa says dragons still exist. 
Of course you're stupid. Are you still <laughs> playing with that boy? How many times have I told you to stay away from him? Is that kid being put to bed at noon? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Well, it's, that's kind of sad, actually. <laughs> uh, besides, it's hocus pocus like that. They're making gold over so remote to us on the main island. Where in the world is there, is there such a thing as the dragon deer? I'm sorry, Mom, but Bacorch's stories are fun to listen to. The story he told me last time about Master Viper's Manor was so scary. No buts. Anything that boy says is a flat-out lie. Any <laughs> child that believes in such nonsense is not a child of this family. <laughs> no way, I belong to this family. No, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> This is why God hates you. <laughs> because you've been hanging out with Cordy. <laughs> there, there. You're not going to get any better if you don't listen to me. Now, if you promise me wow. you won't play with Cordy anymore, I will tell you the next story. Uh, I promise that I won't hang out with my only friend in the world <laughs> as I die from cancer. <laughs> I promise. So please tell me the next story. Yes, yes. That you will be <laughs> promised that is bullshit. <laughs> what should I read you next? Wow. Good parenting 101. I'm not sure. Is this a... Oh, yeah, part of the family, yeah. Is it like, Welcome to the family, son. Exactly. Interesting architecture. Like, it seems like everything's made out of cement. Kind of. Or, uh, coral. Oh, like Coral Castle. Yeah. Neat. Or potentially marble. Maybe it, not marble. It might, it might be coral, man. Or what about like sandstone? Oh, oh, oh. Talk to her. Talk to her. With the pink hair. Yes, who might you be? Grandma, there are travelers passing through. My, my eyes, so sorry. My eyes have become really weak in my old age. And I thought that my grandson had come back. My grandson was such a cute boy. He was really plump and cheerful and loved to make people laugh. That's why the boy joined the circus and became a clown. We all float down here, is what he said. <laughs> what? <laughs> we all float down here, like a it, uh, Pennywise the Clown. Oh, okay. <laughs> he, like he's in the sewer grid. So yeah, that's know. a creep. I see that like image on Instagram. I haven't like seen it, like any of the it movies or read the book. That's like very disturbing. It's very disturbing. For the first few years, he wrote letters to me almost daily. He always said how gra uh, gratifying the work was, although it was very challenging. One day, his letters suddenly stopped coming. I hadn't heard from him since. I hope he hasn't. Uh, he wasn't in an accident or something. I just pray that I might see his cheerful face once more before the heavens come claim my soul. I love the the uh, boats and shit going by. Uh, use yeah, the I'm trying. I'm trying. I know what to do. Yeah, I know. Use Oop. the clown skull. Clown. Use it. What about the big egg? Uh, who flower? was the? What is that creepy thing? Me. Were you Skelly or me? I can't remember. I could do my papyrus voice for Skelly. Oh, dude. You have to. If that wasn't already decided, <laughs> we might have. <laughs> that might have been a conversation. <laughs> okay, that's all what we needed all to right. see. Okay. okay. So, left or right, you decide. Uh, left. <laughs> <laughs> it's up to you, but it's not. <laughs> yeah. I, this is a dead end. I'm pretty sure. Dead end. Dead end. We all float down here. L man, I love the, like, in like you know uh, people unloading stuff from ships and is this like, like a just, weird lion man yeah it's like a um, demi human cool just like in Xeno Gears what are you looking at I'm working here get out of my way you're bothering me uh you're not working what did you just say maybe you don't get it but I'm here to oversee these demi humans these guys always slack on the job if you don't watch them carefully you need to keep my eye I need to keep my eyes peeled um, yeah, demi-human slash furries. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, uh... Wow, that mat is a hundred yen, giant, a hundred yen, uh, bill. Oh, cool. 
Authorized personnel only. If you have no business, keep moving. Can we get on the boat? I'm on a oh. boat. Don't you ever forget. I'm on a boat and it's going fast and... <laughs> How weird is it that T-Pain... Yeah. Like one that Masked Singer season one. How weird is that? Is it, well, I'm sorry, what? T-Pain? Uh, and yeah, I heard T-Pain. He what did won he win? the Masked Singer season one. The Masked Singer? Yeah. That Was that a reality It was like show? a, yeah, it, like kind of like American Idol in a way, but shorter and like, quote, celebs under masks. Oh, I maybe you've told me about this before. Yeah, yeah. For, it, was this like the like precursor to The Voice? No, 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 no. It's oh. new. It's new. Last year. Oh. This is my first time visiting Termina, so I was wondering, uh, uh, wandering around town promoting the band. Live the town, food's great all in all. Pretty nice place. The concert's success seemed almost guaranteed, but just between us, the main star, Nicky, is missing. Have you, heard, have you seen him around? We found him in a daze quite a few times lately. It's like he was here in body, but not in spirit. But man, without him, we're pretty stuck. We can't even start rehearsing for the show. Mickey's supposed to be back soon from searching, but... Ooh. Mickey. Mickey! How was it? Did you find him? No, it's no use. I was able to track him up until he went into Shadow Forest, but... There were knights guarding the entrance of the forest and I couldn't get in. Besides, I really didn't want to be in that creepy forest on my own. There's supposed to be a way into Vi Viper Manor at the end of the forest, but what's that idiot trying to do? I see, so he definitely went into Shadow Forest. Hey, I know. You guys can help me out. I'll lure the knights away from the entrance, then you can go into the forest and find Nikki. Pretty please, won't you ple uh, help out a pretty girl in distress? Okay, this I think- Yeah, this locks us into- This locks us into one way into Viper Manor. Or we could go with Korcha. Uh, and Guile. And Guile. Yes. Yeah, so it's do we want Guile or do we want Mickey, basically? Yes. Because I think you get Korcha either way later at another, at another point. Yeah. If you're not a dick to kid. Yeah. I don't think Korcha ever joins if you're a dick to kid. Okay. Um, wait just a minute. Wait just a minute. I do like that the other option is, okay, rock on. Oh, that's my, that's too bad. But if you change your mind, please let me know. Now, what should we do? I've never done it that, uh, this way. Oh, then let's do it this way. Okay. We are the twin backup dancers. I'm you and she's me. That's cute. We are just stage support for Nikki and Mickey, but some people are going to take the lead on the stage. But when will such a day ever come, huh? You know, Jennifer Lopez once said that. When, when she, will ever such a day come? Yeah, when she was a fly girl on um, In Living Color. Hmm. This area is off limits. All non-staff members, keep out. Okay. Okay. So now, let's go see that, uh, your weird little scene with your weird frog boy. Glenn? Yeah. Who's not frog? No. Who, who's named after frog? He's a little frog boy. <laughs> At first, I remember thinking, oh, shit, it's frog. But, like, the timeline does match up. He's named after frog. Mm-hmm. Whose real name was Glenn? Spoilers. Yes, for huge Corona spoilers. Trigger. For Corona Trigger, Frog's real name is Glenn. <laughs> what? Can I... Oh, there oh, we go. There we go. Wait a Oh, that's less creepy than I thought. Was it? What? How much creepier could it get? Well, it's just like these two big eyes, and then it's just like some little old person. Who might you be? Fortunes be tug, be good, fortunes be bad. Anything from reading your destiny to searching for the missing. Do you wish your fortunes to be read? All it takes is your soul. Who would like a reading? Ah, uh, partial. <laughs> you will die soon <laughs> when I snap, snap your neck. <laughs> Beware of a fat and overeating. Well, I guess that goes without saying. <laughs> 
purchase you. <laughs> All right. Come back anytime. You? Well, this is interesting. You're not dead or anything, are you? Has anybody called you back from the great beyond? You just might be the key to the destruction of this entire planet. I can't say for sure, but your fate seemed to have a great task for you. Be careful now, boy. Boy. Hey, Sergey. That's nothing but rubbish. Let's hurry up and get moving. Hmm, you there. In your eyes, I perceive both the look of beauty and the look of a beast. Ooh, I love that movie. Be mindful not to bring about your own end, my dear. A dream lies in wait, reaching out to engulf you. Sorry, Mum. I don't believe in fortune telling at all. I make way for me, me own future by myself. Lassie, you should listen to your elder's advice. Crikey. <laughs> I don't give a damn. Let's go, Sarah Kay. <laughs> that is all. Sarah Kay. Okay. <laughs> it's funny, it's like she gave us all of our fortunes despite the fact that we didn't click on those names. Let's go north first. North. North, 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 north. Oh. Oh, is that a dog? What is that thing? Oof. It's a corgi. Come on. I'm a corgi. Pushu. Pushu too. Oh, cool. I don't, I've never seen this scene. Pushu too. And this dog ripped Pushu's head. <laughs> Pushu, you rucked out for today. What? Ah, <sighs> I think it's acting like. Like, Poshul tried to intimidate that dog into moving, but that dog didn't move, and Poshul... I was freak, like... Freaked the fuck out. Oh, talk to the, the the gal running the shop. Okay. Ooh, Zipper. Welcome. This here is the official blacksmith of the Acacia Dragoons. We carry only the best goods. Come and take a look. Um... Yeah, so this is introducing, um... Is it worth, like, trying to make anything? Uh, pfft, what can we make? Uh, can we improve, uh, to the steel swallow, or... Oh! We could do the copper... Can we do the copper swallow? Uh, uh, up above? Yeah. Uh, that's better. That's better than what Sergei has. How or, do you know? Oh, I see. You The up upward arrow. This is also better than what Kid has. Yeah. Okay. So I think we should probably. I think that's a sound investment. Okay. For not a lot of money. And then what about for kid? Yeah, absolutely. 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 Uh, Poshal? Don't worry about it. <laughs> um, I don't can't, can't remember if we have to re-equip that shit after the fact. I think so. Okay. Do you have any? Iron with you. We've been out of it for the longest time. For the longest time. Whoa. 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 We could make stronger items. <laughs> Whoa. If we only had some iron. That's a, the less catchy <laughs> version. <laughs> it's like, you know how Weird Al does like the alternate lyrics version? If somebody did one that just like had just lyrics that just did not match the song at all. <laughs> yeah, it's just it, it's like could, embarrassingly bad. We could call ourselves Lazy Al. Oh, <laughs> that'd be cool. This guy looks sick. Zappa. Zappa. Like Frank Zappa? Uh, why don't you be Zappa? I think he has a Scottish accent. How it's written. Ah, how many times do you have to say you didn't let the customers back in you? I, I don't know if I'm doing Scottish. Yeah, that right. sounds like a perfect Scottish. <laughs> okay, Shrek, Shrek, Shrek. Yeah. <laughs> I can't. The thing I'm that I remember, do, I'm trying to remember is, a line from Shrek. This is my methodology for the Scottish accent. You say, "Humane, humane, hebody, hebody," <laughs> and then that just like. Didn't ya? How many years have ye been my wife? Donkey, <laughs> donkey. <laughs> 
Is it but that's uh that's uh, Scottish for donkey. <laughs> um <laughs> yeah. Uh so should I change my thing to do her Scottish? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> What's about him and a him and a him and a hit it? What's about a hey, like you doing worrying about such trivial stuff? <laughs> Don't you be complaining up a storm or what just one or two customers coming to talk to you? Okay, <laughs> how many Let's Plays Don't get. get the opportunity <laughs> that in a single episode get to, like, offend an entire country? <laughs> there's no... There's not to be just one or two, but three. Ah, uh, you're not getting the delicate art of a craftsman like yours, truly. I don't know. Uh, oh. <laughs> and didn't expect a lemon like you to ken what I'm saying, but... The art of smithing may seem only like physical labor, but it requires far more mental prowess. Every time the hammer strikes, a wee bit of my soul goes into it. And guess what uh, I'm saying is, that soul is what makes the sword. So the means you're yapping is just... The means you the, that means you yeah, but it's distracting me. I cannot focus my soul into the steel. Dear Ken, if so, then get going. Oh, that killed me a little bit. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh, why can you not leave me be? The sword is no good. Time to start over. Uh, to Ken is to understand. Oh, okay. Wow, thank God that's over. Ah, oh, fuck me. No! <laughs> Take your business up to the counter, kin. Oh, God damn. <laughs> Never talk to him again. <laughs> if you need something, don't talk to me at the counter. It doesn't look professional if we take back here, right? Oh, and please, don't talk to my hubba back there. He'll throw a fit if you do. Donkey. <laughs> Donkey. Donkey. <laughs> so the only... Ooh. Oh, gosh. <laughs> See, Joe, this game is terrible with, like, its stupid dialect this, written into it. This game is killing me. Yeah, we should be adding this. Oh, uh, well, we we have both exper have experience with... Uh, French accent. Yeah. So, okay. <laughs> there, well, we can offend, uh, offend two different countries <laughs> in a single Let's Play. <laughs> Swordsmanship is as beautiful as a rose. The rouge ambition... The rogue ambition hidden beneath its beauty. Oh, these words fit more perfectly. <laughs> uh, pardon me, monsieur. I forgot to introduce myself. Oh, mon baguette. Oui, oui. Mon name, mon name is Pierre. I am renting this room from Monsieur Zappa. I'm on my way to see this General Viper soon. Oh, is this another way? Oh, dude. From what I hear, there is a vacancy among the four divas. Divas? Yeah. They like, like, like to sing? Yeah. You know, like... Of the Ekasia. Ekakia. <laughs> Ekakia. Dragoons. Such a position is perfect. Uh, how, how would you say perfect in French? Oui, oui. Oui, oui. Okay. That's, that's... <laughs> oui, oui. For such a splendid swordsman <laughs> as more. A grateful flash of one sword uh, will surely have the saluting wise as guest of honor. But I have lost one precious metal, symbol of heroism. Without it, I, w <laughs> I will certainly turn away at the gate. Sacre bleu, what am I to do? Well, that I'm a poet, and I didn't <laughs> even know it. <laughs> I don't know, I slipped into Cockney, why not? <laughs> Call Blimey! <laughs> okay, let's go through this door, and ugh. Wow, this game is a good one for voices. This this game is <laughs> Oh, the corgi moved. Oh, and there's also that like little shack there. Let's check out the shack. <laughs> What's in the shack? It looks like that shack we built in Dragon Quest Builders yesterday. Mm -hmm. Ooh, ooh, hello, Viper Cup. Tournament of Swords, Youth Division, runner-up, Sir Glenn? Smells like Viper's testicles. 
Let me look at this. Let me look. Oh, oh. Viper Cup. Cup. Tournament of Souls. Youth Division first place, Sir Dario. Oh yeah, important character eventually. I'm not talking to him ever again. I can you check the cabinet also as well? I'll check. It is just hopeless. Oh, don't reach to our brothers. They're always fighting over something. Mr. Dario and Mr. Glenn once lived here peacefully. Mr. Dario used to watch over Mr. Glenn, and Mr. Glenn respected his big brother more than anyone else. They were, but they were poor but happy, thinking only of each other's well-being. <laughs> See that just by looking at this room, right? Okay, I'm Thank so God glad. That that oh no, no! Hey, you didn't know that I made you win? Um, okay, so it's introducing that uh, Glenn had a big brother named Dario. Really? Who was I didn't, I didn't better get that at swordsmanship. From, I didn't get that at all from that. I'm not talking to my big brother ever again. Okay. So Glenn and Dario left their trophies just in that shack? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's like... They're modest. They left their corgi behind, which Aww. was another prize. It's a boat. On a boat. Hey, you want to find out what's in this big uh, building up here in next, next episode? Sure. See you next time, everybody. Bye, everybody. Bye.